give your listing a competitive edge during the pandemic. These days, many of our guests are worried about the spread of COVID-19. As a host, you can easily put your guests' minds at ease with some simple additions to your amenities, slight changes to your listings, and reviews from guests, all while differentiating your listing. Tune in to this week's video to find out exactly how. Spoiler alert, this video is not about cleaning and sanitization. Welcome to another episode of Airbnb Uncovered. I'm Matt, the creator of AirbnbUncovered.com and Airbnb Superhost. On this channel, I uncover some of the best kept hosting secrets, as well as share with you everything that I've learned after hosting over 3,000 guests. My tips, tricks, and best practices are focused on helping new hosts earn more revenue, attract the best guests, and achieve Superhost status faster. Over the weekend, some friends and I were discussing travel in the age of the pandemic. I had a couple of friends who said that they were fine with it and they're actually in the process of planning a few trips this summer. But they were the minority in the group. The majority were pretty apprehensive talking about concerns over safety in the plane, the cleanliness of their accommodation, and finding conscientious places to eat. As a host, there's not much we can do about plane travel or restaurants, but many of my recent guests are traveling by car and preparing meals inside my listings. But chances are, they're still having some concerns about their accommodation. There are three main things you can do to put these concerns at ease and make your listing stand out while doing it. The first is to revise your amenities to include items that will help your guests feel safe in your home. The second is to highlight these steps that you are taking to protect your guests in your listing. And the third and final one is to let the reviews tell the story about your additional steps. You'll notice I didn't mention cleaning, and that's because if you follow my channel, you'd have already seen my videos on cleaning and sanitization during the pandemic. If you missed them, then you can click on the little I in the upper right hand corner of this video to watch them. So I'm going to assume that you've got lots of info on cleaning and sanitizing. So this video is all about the other things that you can do to make your listing stand out and make your guests feel safe and secure. So let's start with amenities. You can easily dazzle your guests by providing simple and inexpensive amenities. Things like snacks, shampoo, soap, personal hygiene items, and the like. But in the age of coronavirus, I think you've got to go a little further. You should now include virus prevention items. In my listings, I'm now providing my guests with some basic personal protective equipment. I'm providing things like a small bottle of hand sanitizer, a few disposable medical masks, Lysol wipes, and disposable gloves. And I'm doing this for a few reasons. The first is, well, selfish. I'm okay with hosting during the pandemic, but I do not want my hosting business to be the source of a spread. So by leaving these items, I'm giving my guests all the tools they need to stay safe and to protect my local community. The second reason is that as a guest to a strange city, finding these items could be a bit of a challenge, especially if you've just run out. Like, how are you going to buy a mask when you've run out of them and they're required in every store? Finally, I want my guests to feel safe in my homes. Providing these items does exactly that, and it demonstrates to guests that I'm taking the pandemic very seriously. And therefore, it should instill confidence in my cleaning and sanitization efforts throughout my homes. And it's again all about making guests feel comfortable and safe. Another point along the same lines and something that my Instagram followers will already know is that you should be storing your cleaning supplies in obvious places so that your guests can easily find them. While I wouldn't consider cleaning supplies to be an amenity, I'm mentioning it here because I think that it creates the same feelings of security and concern for my guests. They know that I'm conscientious about the pandemic because I'm giving them every tool they could possibly need to stay safe and healthy. With the additional PPE amenities added to your home, 
you now want to communicate them to your guests via your listing. Add a few lines near the top of your description to highlight these additional items. You could even take a picture of your PPE equipment on display in your home and then add that picture as one of the first few pictures on your listing. Another important thing you can do is to add COVID-friendly icons to your main listing picture. You can get step-by-step -step instructions by watching my instructional video that I created a few months ago. And you can watch it by clicking on the little eye in the upper right hand corner. Like I said, it's from a couple months ago and it doesn't mention an icon for PPE. And that's because I didn't think of it back then. But I've just created a new icon and I've added it. So please don't be alarmed if you see it mentioned or if you don't see it mentioned in the video. And don't worry if you're not tech savvy, I've got you covered. The video goes step by step and has screen captures showing exactly how to do each step. The feedback I've gotten so far in the video instructions has been that it's really easy to do, even if you're not good with the computer. The last part of this strategy is to engage your past guests to help you tell the story of your additional PPE amenities. And this part is powerful because reading about the additional precautions you're taking is gonna mean even more if it's reported by another guest. And this is generally because past consumers, sorry, consumers believe past customers experience over a message from a company or a service provider. It's the adage that products with lots of positive reviews will sell better than those with either no reviews or a couple negative ones. And to see an example, you don't have to look any further than our very own Airbnb platform. Listings with lots of great reviews always outperform listings with just a few reviews or none at all. So you might be asking, Matt, how do I get my guests to write about the PPE amenities that I left for them? Well, the simple answer is that you ask. But just wait. I'm not suggesting that you tell your guests what to put in the review. What I am saying is that you want to ask them if they'll consider it. I'm sending a message to my current guests during their stay that says something like this. Hosting during the pandemic has been pretty hard. Hopefully you notice that I'm doing everything that I can to prevent the spread of COVID-19 and to make you feel safe in my home. Hopefully you've also noticed that I'm doing additional cleaning and sanitization, as well as providing some key personal protection items like the hand sanitizer, the mask, the disposable gloves, and the Lysol wipes you saw when you arrived. If you think that I've done a good job with this, could you kindly note that I've provided these items in your review? I want future guests to know that they can feel safe in my home. If you're not comfortable adding this to your review, then I completely understand. Or maybe you disagree, so if so, please let me know so that I can improve. But please remember that we both write our reviews blind, meaning that we won't see each other's review until they're both written. So there is no way for me to hold this against you. I want your review to be as honest as possible, both the good and the bad, or something, uh, something like that. For many of us, competition has been heating up during the pandemic. There's lots of listings, not a lot of guests. So creating sources of differentiation is going to pay off in more bookings and higher rates. To differentiate from your competition, I'm suggesting that you add some basic PPE to your listings, make your cleaning products and equipment available to your guests, and communicate these actions. Communicate these actions by modifying your listing description to highlight these additions and upload a picture of your PPE amenities to your listing. As well, ask your guests to help you tell this new story in their review. Hosting during the pandemic, has, it's, it's been hard. I'm hoping that the tips I just provided in this video, they're going to help you get more bookings, earn more five-star reviews, and achieve Superhost status faster. If you think that I helped you to do that, then please give this video a thumbs up and rate it highly if you're asked. If you want more content like this, then please check out my other videos and consider subscribing to my channel. Once you subscribe, you're going to want to click on the notification bell so that you won't miss out on my new videos that come out weekly. Thanks again for watching and until next week, bye for now.